guys, Tyler here, and I want to talk to you about how to hold a perfect handstand, specifically a 30-second handstand. And so these drills are some drills that I've used to build up the strength in order to hold that 30-second handstand. So one of the biggest mistakes people make is that they don't build up enough wrist strength when performing the handstand. They jump straight into trying to kick up and they stumble all over the place. So the first drill is just simply the frog stand, okay? For the frog stand, what you're going to do is bring your elbows to your knees and you're going to use the strength of your hands to hold you up. And you lift your toes off the ground and hold this position right here. And the goal is to hold the frog stand for at least twice as long as you want to hold the actual handstand. So if you're having troubles balancing, you can't kick up for more than 10 seconds, work on that frog stand and get to the point where you can hold that position for somewhere around like 60 seconds before worrying about going on to a 30 second handstand. Now the next drill to strengthen your wrist even further is going to be using that same position to bring your head down to the ground and then pressing back up. So from here, use your wrist strength to bring your head down to the ground and then from there, try to come back up to that frog stand position without moving. Head down, use your wrist, back up, try to find that balance point. This is an extremely challenging drill to use, okay? So make sure you use that one sparingly. Make sure you, you do it like two or three days a week so you don't injure your wrists in the process. Once you do these two exercises, you're going to have built the strength in your wrists in order to hold that vertical position. But one of the better ways to work on holding that vertical position in conjunction with these wrist drills is just to work on a simple headstand. So, simple way to do that, head on the ground. You've already worked your wrists. You're bringing your feet up. Everything stays tight, and you try to hold this position right here for at least 60 seconds. The reason why it's good to hold this position for 60 seconds is because if your goal is to hold a 30 second handstand, then being used to being inverted for 60 seconds is going to help big time in the long run. Now finally, once you've strengthened your wrists, once you've strengthened your position of that handstand, all you've got to do is come back up, get your form right, and start working on that perfect handstand. So kicking up, finding your good position, gripping the ground, hopefully holding it for 30 seconds, and then coming back down under control. If you guys dig this video, click the like button right there. Help me spread the warrior message to more people just like you so I can teach them how to work out at home, how to use their body weight, and how to live the warrior lifestyle. Thanks for watching.